Chances are you've played a game or read a cyberpunk novel that's featured characters with super awesome bionic body parts at some point. Uh, Jax from Mortal Kombat, Adam Jensen from Deus Ex, or Barrett Wallace from Final Fantasy, just to name a few. And the idea of powered artificial limbs that work just as well as real ones or even better has long been a mainstay in fiction. But could we be getting close to making this a reality for people who have been unlucky enough to lose an arm or a leg? If so, it'll have been a long time coming. False limbs and digits made from materials such as wood, iron, and leather have been in use for millennia. Everywhere from ancient Egypt to the Roman Republic to the high seas of the 16th century where peg legs were famously used by pirates. But even though prosthetics have been around a long time, for the vast majority of their history, they didn't provide much functionality other than aesthetics. Except for artificial legs that would at least allow a person to stand. And while various people over the centuries have created designs to make prosthetics more functional, such as rudimentary joints at the knees, the biggest advancements have been made in the past few decades. Modern manufacturing processes have allowed the production of artificial limbs that often look like the real deal and also seriously improve the quality of life for the people who use them. And computer-aided design has enabled precise measurement and modeling of prosthetic body parts customized for each patient, as well as the manufacture of high-quality joints and moving parts modeled closely after their natural counterparts. Additionally, materials like silicone and polyvinyl carbonate have been used for artificial skin and hair so that prosthetics don't have to look like and or feel like cold hunks of metal or plastic. But how do patients actually control these things? Many prosthetics work with mechanical systems powered by the user's own body. For example, artificial hands that can open and shut thanks to a cable system that can be operated with simple gestures, such as moving a shoulder. Other prosthetics use myoelectrics, the electrical impulses that contract your muscles. So you'll have electrodes that are attached to the same place as the prosthetic that can pick up these impulses and send them to the artificial limb, which then moves according to what the patient wants it to do. But the real excitement in the field surrounds prosthetics that are controlled completely by thought, the same way you'd control an original body part. In recent years, scientists have developed sensors that can be directly implanted beneath the skin and that interface with the nerves, so that when the brain sends an impulse to your arm that says, hey, pick up that can of soda, the sensor can send that impulse to a processor which will direct the limb to follow your brain's orders. Cool, right? We're even seeing this technology take a step further with sensors embedded in prosthetic hands to send signals to the brain and restore a patient's sense of touch, just like Luke Skywalker in The Empire Strikes Back. And this new generation of smart prosthetics doesn't stop at artificial limbs. People who suffer from impaired vision may have more options in the future as eye implants that project images directly onto the retina could help patients that have suffered physical trauma and implants that make contact with the brain hooked up to a small camera could bypass the eye entirely and provide your brain's vision center with images from the outside world. Just don't expect anything that will let you see through walls anytime soon. Unless, of course, you're the NSA. Speaking of walls, let's break down some barriers here with FreshBooks. And when I talk barriers that FreshBooks can break down, I'm not talking walls, I'm talking business barriers. FreshBooks is on a mission to make freelancers and small business owners less stressed and more organized with their easy to use tools for crafting and sending professional invoices in seconds. It also helps you track your hours so you know exactly what to put on that invoice when the time comes, what you did, when you did it, and who you did it for. You can even accept deposits through their platform so your work is paid for on your schedule. Speaking of getting paid for, your customers can pay through the app with their credit card and you can get a confirmation when you know that they've received it, making the billing process that much simpler. Getting started on FreshBooks is extremely simple even if you're not a numbers person, actually especially if you're not a numbers person and you can try FreshBooks 
free for 30 days by going to freshbooks.com forward slash tech quickie and entering tech quickie in the how did you hear about us section. So thanks for watching guys. If you liked this video, hit the like button. If you disliked it, well, there's the other button there for you, unless you're watching on Vessel, in which case it's not there. <laughs> also check out our other channels. We've got a great video up on Channel Super Fun with us jousting on swagways, so don't miss that. Leave a comment if you have video suggestions for future Fast as Possibles, and as always, subscribe slash follow for more videos just like this one.